My name is Ricardo Contero. I was born in Panama City, Panama, and I was raised here in Hamilton. The way that I got started uh, is elementary school. I could always remember always picking up pencils and crayons and stuff to, to draw to impress my friends, and they would always crowd around, so I knew that my artwork stood out a little bit. Um, and then I kind of followed art through high school and university. Um, and even in college I did some graphic design work and stuff as well, so, so I kind of knew I was going to be an artist. My greatest influences, I think, are more the people who taught me to, to explore artwork. So my instructors, my mentors, um, and my parents. I try not to look at too much artwork because it discourages me. Um, so I really just create stuff based on, on people in my personal life. What I love most about my work is that it's not only for me, I mean, a lot of the things I create mean something personal to me, but um, they include everyone in my life, uh, especially my family members, they're always dealing with me being the artist in the house. I volunteer them to participate in all my projects and stuff, so, so I think it's just the personal thing and, um, and I think a lot of people can relate to them, uh, so that's kind of exciting. I think with Becoming an artist, um, if you want to get started, it's important to, to kind of figure out what type of artist you want to be. Um, if you want to pursue being represented by a gallery, I'd say find something that you really like doing, you're good at, and make a lot of work. Um, I'm the type of artist who likes to learn as I create, so um, if you also want to follow that type of idea, just go crazy, try, try different mediums, try different styles. Um, involve everything around you and your artwork and, and you'll come up with some pretty cool things. My plans for the future are unknown. I don't like to plan too far ahead. Um, but I do know that I, I'd like to be in another gallery space, uh, get back to exhibiting artwork a little more frequently. And I was raised here in Hamilton, so kind of get my name out here um, a little more. Some of my favorite pieces that I've created um, come from a collection that I did called Still Motion. It evolved from filming um, small seconds of someone's life and painting from that. Um, it was kind of a quest or a study of a quest to find out who you are. But even as I speak to you, I'm not the same person I was one second ago because now you're different because I'm telling you about this work and I'm different because um, I'm kind of exhibiting something different. So. It's the still motion was a series of illustrations of people in, in a really small amount of their, their lifespan, like milliseconds kind of thing. So, so it's kind of just evolved around there. And I did a specific piece um, with my family. So it's kind of a family portrait as much as it is passed down uh, physical traits from my parents. I'm the last in my family, so the things that they've taught me um, the similarities in our appearances and kind of like that kind of just passed down and that's probably one of my favorite pieces.